Well, it might seem like a weird move to be talking about ice hockey and this Got a sweater over little, here. A little too big for me, but that's <laughs> it. Uh, during a day like today. But when hockey legend Lou Nanny is here, you make an exception. Lou, thanks for joining us here on The Four. Thank you very much. It's my pleasure. Yeah. Good to see yeah, you. you can make some noise for that. Come on, we got a legend with us. Yeah, today. we got to we got to talk about a major, massive event for hockey fans, particularly for the youth. What is coming to Minnesota in just a few years? Well, Minnesota has been awarded the 2026 World Junior Hockey Championship, which is one of the premier events in the United States, and uh, it'll start December 26th of 2025 and go till January 5th of 2026. We've had over 190 players from Minnesota play in this event, but every top player that plays in the National Hockey League basically has played in this event. This is so big that in Canada, if there's not a Canadian team in the semifinals or finals, the ratings for the Stanley Cup won't be as big as the ratings for the Canadian team wow. watching in the World Junior. And for us, I think it's really important because Minnesota will have almost three weeks of constant commercials. The NHL Network covers it for 24 hours a day and every country covers it so minnesota will be focused and in, in, uh, in really spotlight. shown in the spotlight for all that time it's a big thing for minnesota who's all participating in this tournament well it'll be the best juniors they haven't picked it yet because uh, you know we're a year away and there will be considerable changes in who's good who's not good but it'll be the best juniors in the usa but then we have if rush ever gets their thing uh, if that war stopped, they'd come back. But you got the Czechs, the Finns, the Swedes, the Germans, the, the uh, Slovaks, the Canadians, the U.S. So you got 10 great teams that are going to be there. How significant is it, Lou, right now for Minnesota to be hosting this event? Well, I think it's really significant. I was very, very worried because uh, Seattle and, and Las Vegas were making a big play for it. And we haven't had it since 1982 or 83. It's been five other cities in the U.S. since that time. And it, it's become such a big deal that uh, it looked like, you know, maybe other towns had more money than us wanted to put towards the uh, acquisition of this tournament. But we were able to get it. I think they realized how important. Minnesota's got more hockey players in the United States, boys and girls, than any other state. they got more players in college. That's right, Minnesota. Yeah. <laughs> they, got, they got more players in the NHL. And, and the young ladies are incredible. That's what I said. And they have more than anywhere else. So it, it would have been really upsetting if we weren't able to acquire this tournament. And if people are curious, Team USA is pretty good. We did well in the last oh, tournament. Oh, yeah. We've, we've, done, we've been fortunate. I, I want to say since Zach Parisi's team, it was around 2006, they won the Golden Halifax at that time, we've won a number of golds, a number of silvers, a number of bronze. We always are a threat because the American player now is as good as any player in the world. That's right. And we, and we get all these kids that are in college coming to play, so we've got good teams. All right. Well, the 2026 World Junior Championship, as you heard, is coming to Minnesota from December 26, 2025 to January 5, 2026. To sign up, to get pre-sale offers, or to volunteer, just head to worldjuniorsmn26.com. Thank you so much, Thanks, Lou. Thanks. Nice to see you, Lou. Enjoy the fair.